Hello, hello. Hello, hello. I hope everybody is doing well today. So, <laughs> I mean, it's like he made it sound like he thought the default was mobile Twitch. Do both of you guys mostly use Twitch on your phone? Because to me, mobile's like a last resort for Twitch. Really. I use mobile if I have to because like you don't have better T TV for auto channel point collection and a lot of the other niceties <laughs> I, uh, I don't know about that comparison have but uh I'll take it. Just watch on two accounts at work, so oh. <laughs> well it's appreciated impasta. Yeah, I don't know. I guess I didn't realize that uh mobile Twitch was popular. I always feel like it's a uh much less effective way to watch but they've probably upgraded it a lot so today we were going to start with chatting but then um, do a guided meditation with some breathing and counting and I have some positive mantras that I was going to say but the real um, bulk or plan of today was uh, I'll turn out the light and we're going to do some hand movements with super slow whisper which is always hard for me to do with live, but we will try. Um, wh whisp, whisp, what? Um, yeah, pretty much stranger in the dark. Do everything mobile, kids grabby, understandably. Um, honestly, the only nicety I can really think of is the auto, re like, channel point collection. So I hate that I have to press a button to get my channel points. Maybe they change that, but don't have better TTV. Naughty, naughty, Jonathan. It's got so many basic things you need. That's like so dark and busta. Reminds me of... Uh, Drilla with the, the dark background. So, today was insanely busy at work. Um, it was, oh, it's raining again. It was a good day, um, but I didn't get like a moment break to breathe. Everyone was so needy, including staff, <laughs> and um, found out my para, so the person I work with all day, and we have a lot of routines established, will be taking the day off tomorrow. That's fine. I take days off, too. But she didn't get a substitute, 
and the one that was automatically chosen is an old childhood um, friend's mom and without giving too much away or anything too weird uh, he was my first secret uh, boo so to speak while dating girls and uh, his mom is in like he was an accident and they, his parents were much older and his mom is this type of person who writes letters to the editor to all the local newspapers about you know the evil gays and about uh, just all sorts of conspiracy theories so to have her in the class is going to be so awkward she loves me but she likely does not know that uh, I was her son's first experience and vice versa so yeah Jonathan she disowned him when he was uh, 17 but absurdly he walked down well he knew these people but down the street were some millionaire lesbians that took him in for his last year before adulthood so collect extra channel points for the most part oh okay maybe I imagined it being needed to click a button then and hi courts and R when he's back um, yeah she she writes some crazy stuff but loves me so courts um, I will say the whole school feels like one but it's just a normal public school but I teach specifically in a program for like what you're talking about um, kids removed from bigger classes and put into like five to ten kid classes because of their behavior or attendance or emotions um, so a lot of the times the the life stories are unbelievable so that's honestly one of the heaviest parts of the job I can deal with the kids any day of the week but some of the crap that they deal with is what's hard and that's totally fine Arwen in a little bit it'll be all guided meditation and then super slow whisper in the dark so I'll be sleepy 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 I, uh, I do not get to punch the kids and honestly the kids aren't the main ones I'd uh, want to punch it's laptops apparently based on my track record and uh, certain adults in their lives especially anyone who's sexually abused but all of the crappy ones um, yeah hot tea helps Michael's actually fighting something right now so it must be the season um, what's up moose been a while the meditation does heal sickness and that was the goal north zero. Oh, the raffle is open though so that could be related to it hola I think yo penso hola <laughs> I don't know hi um, going around where you're at sore throat losing your voice yeah tis the season but this meditation is focused on health um, including immune system so yeah it's um it is kind of funny because they said it was going to rain and then it didn't like all day at all and then at night there was no chance of it and now it's downpouring so <laughs> not exactly the nicest wording Arwen but um, 
I I do fuck with lots lozenges, lozenges, lozenges. Elderberry, we have a tree, two of them, and I've been told they're just good for you in general. So, all right, I will not respond to chat as much for a few minutes here. And I urge you all to take a deep, deep breath. Breathe it out. In. And out. When I breathe in, I like to visualize so I close my eyes and I suggest you do the same and as I breathe in I picture this like blue line or energy thank you for the follow around my body and as I breathe in that blue sort of flows in through my breathing and spreads down my body. And I visualize that in my head. And it makes me get tingles. Tingle, 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 tingle. Down my body. Try something like that. Your color may not be blue. Whatever color feels like healing and protection and calm. So, breathe in. Let it flood down to the tips of your toes and breathe out. In and out. Sometimes when I have lingering thoughts or weirdness, we're going to go ahead and do this. On the out breath, I visualize those negative thoughts just pushing out, pushing out. blue in and for me it's red out in and out and slowly I work towards counting as I breathe in one two three Four, hold it, one, two, three, four, and out, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Trying to breathe out for longer than you breathed in always helps relax me. So 
some of the mantras that I like to say once I'm at that point is things like, and I got them in like a little notepad here. So, and I focus on the good things. It is, cards. I focus on the good things. My present is beautiful and calm. My present is beautiful and calm. I choose to laugh at challenges. I choose to laugh at challenges. This one I use a lot at work. Today is a good day. Today is a good day. And whenever I think about that I don't actually believe what I'm saying on the next out breath, I try to picture those thoughts push out. Like that redness, push out. Maybe two more here. This one has been more important to me lately because I try to remind myself it's not a big deal if I spent my night um, just doing nothing or writing or gaming or streaming. So I appreciate the time I have I appreciate the time I have. I shape the time I have. I shape the time I have. So time's going fast like it often does. We'll do one last mantra and then I'm going to turn out the light and we'll do hand movements with super super slow whisper I got you quartz yeah doing nothing is damn near impossible It's okay to focus on self-care. It's okay to focus on self-care. In, two, three, four, hold. Some of them are, I feel, very specific to me, Jonathan and Quartz, but I will share them with you. Um, so excuse for a little writing sound. Oh, it's raining. Some of them were from already existing guided meditations, but most 
slash several were just things I needed to tell myself on the way to work. And then when I got to work, I'd write down the thoughts because they're what I deal with. I feel like a lot of mantra meditations focus on I am enough or, um, you know, kind of self-esteem focused one, which I know we all need work with. Um, but for me, it's often more about uh, dealing with the passage of time and my hyperness and my thought process. So it's true. I got them all from Hallmark cards because I'm a huge Hallmark guy after all.
so
I've always liked. But yeah, most likely see you guys tomorrow. Um, I don't know if North started streaming yet. No. Uh, Northward is planning to stream tonight. It won't be ASMR, but maybe we could pressure him into it. So, appreciate you all.